I will be playing a Pokemon randomized Nuzlocke, but with a twist. My Pokemon will be represented like chess pieces with their own rules and regulations while I try to traverse through Pokemon White. The second episode was a crazy doozy, getting some extra encounters and everything, and as we prepare for the next gym, I can definitely say, there is some trouble that happens. Hello, hot cousins. Welcome to the door and again. Open the door with a Pokemon White chest lock. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe for more content, ding that bell for any notifications whenever I post something, and check out all the other social medias I have in the description down below. Like, I do post on my personal stuff, like Instagram, maybe sometime, maybe Twitter. You know, like, I do have a picture, blop, of me making some, like, recipes and stuff. So, you know, you could follow me to see what I could do. I mean, it's not much, but hey. But with that out of the way, how is everybody doing today? Hope everybody have a fantastic day today. I managed to eat. I walked the doggo. I'm all good. Happy recording stuff now, finally. We're going to go to Queen. Uh, pfft, I can learn to speak correctly during this whole video, but it's most likely not going to happen. We're going to do a quick team recap over here. We got Queen K rule our queen over here with Sand Tomb, Bite, Sand Attack, and while I was grinding through, I managed to find a TM for Shell Smash. Which is insane if I don't choke up myself. <coughs> but I managed to find a thing for Shell Smash. So that's amazing considering I'm at like, you know, up on attack nature 35. Shell Smash raises speed twice and attack rise. So yeah, no, it's good. And then we also have a Hentai, the tentacle over here. Our first bishop with uh, acid, toxic spike, supersonic, and poison sting. You know, like this is really cool with the toxic spikes and everything. We have our King Latios over here with Side Wave, Safeguard, Heal Block, and Dragon Breath. And then last but not least, we have Lieutenant Surge over here. The second bishop that we got. Unless we get a pawn, that is going to be the last bishop that we can get. Um, with Shell Smash, also very good. Uh, Tail Whip, Quick Attack, and Thunderbolt. So yeah, that is exactly what I've done here. <laughs> I think others can learn Shell Smash, but like for Hentai, I'm not really worried about it. But for Lieutenant Surge and Queen K Rule, that is a menace. It is a menace to do that. It really is a menace to do that because it's just like they're already good special attack and decent speed. Double their their normal attacking stats and their speed. Oh yeah, no, they're going to start killing things. They're just going to go and just die. But I did manage to grind off screen and stuff like that. Managed to get what I needed to get done. So then now, I should be all good to do gym. But before I do, let me see if I bought potions. Uh, I got three. I got three. But I don't know how much money I have. How much money do I have? Okay. Uh, I got 10,000. You know what? I'm going to be right back. I'm going to cut when I first, like, either whenever I do that puzzle or whenever I do the trainer or stuff like that. Because I'm going to go buy some stuff. So I'll be right back. This is not work on his randomized. It does not work at all. At all. What do you got? Clefable? Uh, that's nothing compared to me. Nothing. Oh, I don't like that at all. I don't like that at all. So we're going to shell smash here. <laughs> Tremble in fear before me. Oh, you're gonna be annoying, aren't you? Cause the thing is, I have a uh, fable. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. Well, if I ever can hit this Pokemon, I'm pretty sure I might kill it, but. Now it's gonna be super hard to hit. Yeah. Oof. Okay. So I have a Clefable in EBL and stuff like that. I have it for season six here. And I didn't go with this strat for the first battle. You will see it tomorrow. But this is what some of the strats I know people have told me to do. <laughs> I didn't use this strat for the first battle. Maybe later on, but not for this one. Oh, I'm like minus two defense. I'm like minus two. No, no, no. Stop, 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 stop. Okay, 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 okay. Um, 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 um. <laughs> Queen Gate Rule's got like minus two defense. I'm five double slap is gonna kill it. No.
You know what? I was okay with that. I was okay with that. I was okay with that. Um, can I quick attack land? No. What you doing? What you doing? What you doing? And prism. I'm pretty sure I can still use quick attack. Yeah. And it does land. But it doesn't kill. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Yeah. Um, I'm just gonna do a thunderbolt. Just... I'm okay with Peck. So far, we've had nothing amazing come from this metronome. And at least we managed to knock it out. Okay. Ooh, that, that minimize. Like, oh my gosh, it is so terrifying to do that. It is so terrifying to do that. But I also feel like if I didn't, like, shell smash twice, I would have been better off. I would have been way better off. The normal... I forgot what the first trainer had. You've got to be kidding me. I mean, it's only special attack, but, like, that's crazy. That is very crazy. Um. I feel like Hentai's got this. I feel like Hentai's got this. But Hecla Fable had all normal types. I want to say the first one was a normal type. So if she still has a normal type gym. Stop! Unfortunate for me. Does it does, is Skill Link in this gen? Is Skill Link in this gen? Or did it just get really lucky? <laughs> I was gonna toxic spikes in and everything! But I guess not anymore! Wow! Okay, okay, okay! <laughs> you, you killed my Pokemon! And like I, I love Ursa Egg. You were, you were, you were fantastic, Hentai. Is all I can say. You were fantastic. There's nothing else I could have done. You killed my Hentai. I am here for revenge. Like you did, but civilian did already get my revenge. But I still am gonna get my revenge on you. Okay, so it is a normal type gem. Okay, okay. Um, I'm pretty sure you can't one-shot me. But you are a little bit of a high level, so we're gonna sand attack real quick. I meant bite. I meant bite. I meant bite. I got so lucky with that. I got so lucky with that. His up four is a special attacking move, but it's like 90 base power. With a, with a minus special defense, I don't think I would have lived that. Meowth, I got it. The most I can do is fake out, and I'm pretty sure it can't one-shot me even with a fake out. But it does do a lot of damage. It only does the fake out, okay. Now, unless like, I feel like I could bite the first Pokemon, I have to switch out here. Skitty. I don't think it gets Fake Out. I don't think it gets Fake Out. But it could have Assist. Which could get Fake Out. So we're not going to do that. I'm like, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah. Let's just go ahead and switch out of here just to be safe. Well, I'm like, sorry to disappoint you, Leora, Liana, I forgot your name already. I'm just gonna Thunderbolt it, one shot your skitty, and just kill it. <laughs> Ra your name is Rachel now, okay? I don't know what your uh, actual game name is, but your name is Rachel, okay? So, yeah. This gym was not without sacrifice. Holy crap. 
We do manage to get another uh, inside pinwheel forest encounter, so hopefully we can get like something really cool. That's not bad. Cause I think it's normally retaliate. Yeah, that's not bad. Yeah, because what happened here is like, oh my gosh, they are stealing some bones. And they steal the rock, I think. They're like, oh no. Oh no. They basically what they're at. So it's just extra dialogue. We know most of this game here by now. I'm just going to go ahead and probably just skip to whenever I get the encounter. Oh. Oh, that's going to do some damage. Oh my gosh. Okay, I don't like that. That Paris almost killed my Crocker Rock. Because I forgot I updated the moves. I think it was a Gen 6. The Gen 6 is whenever Leech Life got really good. <laughs> so that just. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> I was expecting Paris to be like. Eh. But then it was like from the anime where it goes, eh, and it goes, blah, 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 like it does against Pikachu in the anime. Uh, but that's just a. Oh my gosh. We are getting our first encounter in the. Oh, uh, no, we're not. Never mind. I was, uh, <laughs> never mind. I thought we were getting an encounter, but I guess not. Okay, so no, yeah, hate to sell but sorry for that slight interruption there. But we are getting our first encounter, which is... I need, to, I, I need pawns. And it's one of those, I already do have an electric type with Raichu. But it's not a bad pawn to have. Because Electros can be very strong. Um... Yeah, I just don't know if I can hit it. Is that the weak? Well, Psywave does fix damage, so I can't control it. Um. No, no. Um, let's just try throwing a ball. But I'll take a time if it was a pawn. I meant, like, I kind of need to catch some pawns, I'm not going to lie. Let's just throw a Pokeball at it. Okay. It's got a life orb? I mean, okay. That is crazy to think about. Oh, come on! You were so close there! But I would definitely put this in, like, the PC, if anything. Or maybe just keep it on me, just maybe I can have it happening or something. Listen here, buddy. Listen here, buddy, okay? I need you to stay in the Pokeball, okay? That's what I need you to do. I need you to stay in the Pokeball. There we go. Wasn't there a Thunderstone in the right next town next to me? I'm going to go back and look at that after catching this. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to catch this and as a, as a pawn. Because it makes most sense. Yeah, but I'm gonna go see if there is a Thunderstone back in the other town, because if there is, I can go and buy it. May not use it right now, but, yeah. Oh, okay, this thing is Shadow Tag. Um, I don't know how much a Thunderbolt's gonna do, but we could try it. Not as much as I would like to do that, honestly. Not as much as I would like that to do. That's not bad. I'm glad I, I'm glad I got that. Ooh, Levani heads very hard. Oh, come on. He lived on that much. He lived on that much. Ah! I'm glad I got quick attack still. Because that would have really sucked if it would have outsped me. I'm pretty sure it would have outsped it, but it still would have sucked. Like, just in case. 
Uh, Boizel. I should be fine. That was a very risky thing to do. Because I don't know what level it gets Aqua Jet at. I was thinking about that when I was out there. I'm like, that's a very risky thing to do with Aqua Jet coming into play. I'm just glad it didn't go down. Because I would have not necessarily cried, but like I would have been very upset that I lost two bishops. So, yeah. So many trainers! Why is everything so hard for Lieutenant Surge here? Paralyzed twice, got uh, ran into a Levani with Bug Bite, and... F <laughs> it seems like all the grass times that Lieutenant Surge is after, he's just like, I can't... Probably should have done this the first turn, but I was like, ah, hey, it's a Badoo, I got it. No, I don't. <laughs> no, I don't. So now this thing's gonna die. Now he's gonna die, most likely, so yeah. There it goes. Okay, I was just like, come on now. I kind of don't want this to happen anymore. Cause I didn't buy another paralyzed heal. That's for poison. Oh no, I did not use the paralyzed heal. Okay, I thought I did in the last one. So that's why I was like, I didn't use the paralyzed heal. Ah, oh, this is just lovely. You're very big and scary. No, that's big and scary, but like you're very big and scary, but here's the thing. I have a thing called Thunderbolt. You need to just die from it. So, you're no longer that big and scary. Honestly, that's how that hand should have handled any Godzilla, honestly. Just shoot it with a bunch of lightning. Don't think that would have worked at all, but I meant, like, it doesn't sound like a bad strat. Just shoot the giant dino- uh, not dino- well, kind of dinosaur. Giant lizard dinosaur behemoth thing. Just go... Lightning! Godzilla's a water type. Honestly, no, I think Godzilla would be more like a dragon typing. Ooh, what do we get from the old Amber? Okay, um, so you are a trainer. But, like, no, like, honestly, like, what would you see as Godzilla? Because, I mean, he might be electric type, actually, because of the energy beams he shoots out. I meant, like, he could say. But, like, he's definitely, like, he could be, like, a dragon water, dragon electric... Um, why is he out front? Oh yeah, I forgot, because he's a higher level, so I switched him out. I was like, wait a minute, where'd right you go? Kubo top as fast as F, boy! But it doesn't matter, because he's down. But I can see like, him be like a dragon water, a dragon electric. I don't know about dragon fire, though. I don't think so. Because the energy beams, I would see more like electricity. So maybe, maybe, you know, shooting electricity at Godzilla may not be the best thing, actually. I could be wrong about that.
Do you have the dragon ice head? Cause if you do, I'm going to destroy you. <coughs> I'm warm a damn. Okay, now normally I would try to stealth smash first cause I don't really, I'm afraid of this thing, but it is bug type. So like I am going to just crunch it. I mean bite it, not crunch it, but. See, I'm scared of having a bug bite just on the random chance. Embargo. I'm not worried about Embargo. Electivire. I'm actually going to stay in. Mm, you have low kick, don't you? I think you have low kick. Quick attack. Okay, okay. If it, if it had low kick, it would have used it by then. That's what I feel like. Or are you baiting me? Well, it doesn't matter anymore because you're dead. I was like, are you baiting me? Because I didn't know good for a quick attack again. I was like, no, we're not doing that today. But I'm okay. We're all good. I was like, no. Because knowing my luck, he would have quick low kick, quick attack, thinking, ah, he ain't going to do nothing against me. And then low kick me and Cockerock would have died. I went, oh, that was really sad for me. <laughs> Yes, I got the stole back. Oh, we have the wise sage. Garm. Just gonna skip through the dialogue because everybody else is like, We are the sages of the Team Plasma. We are like the admins of the place. We are going to liberate all Pokemon from their trainers because we feel like Pokemon trainers are abusing their Pokemon. And it's like, I mean, like, we, we make them fight, but it's also one of those just, if they want to fight, they can fight. Ooh, a Moonstone. I'll take that. But other than that, it's just like, eh. Like, not every Pokemon has to fight. Normally, good trainers are like, oh, hey, you don't want to fight? That's okay. We could just live together and have, you know, good things. Like, I know there is the one lady in, um... The one lady in... It's in the Sinnoh anime, where she literally makes, like, a Poffin farm. Not a Poffin farm, but, like, she makes Poffins. And so her Pokemon just help her grow the flowers and stuff. This is always so cool when you come up here. Because this shows you this, like, magnificent bridge. And we're going to do speed up on. But it's just, like, so cool how they made this in, like, the DS game and stuff like that. It's not much speed up, but it is speed up. But it's just, like, so cool how grand and majestic they make this bridge in. Like, it's just so huge, so big, so majestic. And, like, you see the boats, you see the cars, you see, like, the different sides of the panels and stuff like that. I think because they, because I know, I think, uh, this is modeled after U.S., this entire region. So, I think this after modeled after, like, the New York Bridge, uh, Manhattan Bridge is the name of it. The San Francisco Gold, I don't know from the name of it, I want to say it's the Golden Gate Bridge, but I could be wrong. But they modeled, uh, they modeled those bridges, like that bridge, over those bridges like that. And it's just so cool how they take, like, the different regions with the different types of, like, content, continents, not content, continents. And they make the regions and stuff like that. Okay, I think there's no sewers in this one. So that means I may not get an encounter at the moment. Unless I can go to the desert area and see if I can get something there. But I don't know if I can get close enough. That is the thing. Yes. That's just one of those, just, yes, that's my answer, just yes. Move out of that way, because I think this is supposed to be modeled after, like, New York City is what this is. It's supposed to be modeled after New York City. I'm not 100% sure, but like I said, I think that's what most of it's supposed to be. 
Um, I can look through this myself. I don't think there's going to be anything major in here except for like items or TMs. So I'm not really worried about showcasing this stuff. I just want to see if I can get maybe the um, next encounter, which looks like I can. Okay, okay. I don't have Thunder Wave, so I'm okay. But let's see here. I got one pawn. I wouldn't mind another one because I'm going like to try to maybe evolve with the next gem. A Cubone. I already have a ground type, but it's not a bad pawn backup. I'm st I like Marowak. Marowak is really good. I, to me, at least. I like Marowak a lot. Um, now, I don't think a Sand Tomb is going to kill it. Yeah, it doesn't kill it. Okay, that did a little bit of damage. I'm not going to lie there. I think Crocorock's just, like, really frail. <laughs> is why some of the problems I've been at. Like, not really problems, but, like, as well as, like, Crocorock kind of dies pretty quickly sometimes. But it's not a bad secondary pawn and stuff like that. Because if, like, Crocorock goes down, I can maybe use this as, like, a Rook. I mean, a Rook could be really good for this, honestly. But I want to save, like those that I know I can add onto the team versus like this. It's a nice pawn. And I can, if I crock rock ever goes down, I can put this on the team, try to win a major battle with it, and I can promote it to the next thing and stuff like that. <laughs> okay. Uh, I want, I'm, let's go ahead and show off the Q-Bone here because I did give it a really funny name. You ever heard of the game called Whack Fuck? It's pretty much Whack Fuck. <laughs> That's what I nicknamed it. Oh, it has up and attack natures, which is really cool. Uh, it does have plus, though, unfortunately, but okay. I'm still going to go ahead and put this in the PC. We still got 48 minutes. I don't know what else I can go do. Let me see how far I can get. Um, what do you say here? Okay, so they want you to challenge a gym. Okay, so if anything, I managed to at least get another encounter... I have two fossils I can go do too, so like I can spend the time to go back getting the fossils, and then I'll have pretty much get the poke up me get the episode here. Mantine would have not been bad. I don't have a water type. I don't know what other moves I could kind of get, because the rooks I see is gonna be the hardest. Because I'm gonna have to look at move pulls in order to get rooks, because they can't have like secondary effects. Now I may not count recoil as part of the secondary effects. Just because I'm like, I ain't gonna worry about a move that has recoil or not, but like, a, stand, a, a chain thing for like status or flinches is basically what I'm gonna be looking at when it comes to that type of stuff. Is what I'm gonna be looking at. Like, straight damage and like, recoil. No status, no flinches, no, no stat drops, nothing like that. If it harms myself, then I see it could be used because I'm just harming myself at the end of the day. Because, like, for example, close combat. It lowers my defense and uh, uh, defense and special defense. So I'm not really worried about that. But as long as it doesn't make it to where it's easier for the other player, if that makes sense. I don't think there's anything back here, but I just kind of want to see. I may explore this on my own for, like, training and stuff. Because I don't know what level the uh, gym is. I need to look that up. So, okay, let me get out of here. I'm going to go back to the other place and get the fossils. And that'll probably end off the episode here. So let me go ahead and do that. I'll come back and explore this stuff and I'll record it in case y'all need to see it. We're here. We're changing the root fossil now to a Pokemon. Let's see what it's going to be. An Onyx. I don't have Metal Coat. And I would love Steelix, but I don't have Metal Coat. Mm, I'm not going to take an Onyx here. I would love Steelix, don't get me wrong, but I don't know where a Metal Coat is. And I necessarily don't want to find it. No, wait! Metal Coat's at the beginning. There's a Metal Coat at the beginning. I remember that. I'm like 95% sure. Still, it's also a Rock type too. So, like, I will definitely take this pawn. And some of those that may double up on the ground typing, but it... Yeah. Yeah, it's a rock type. And which will turn into a steel type later. So, like, even then, that's still a really good typing. 
Um, and like I could put Onyx with me. Mm. I know the memes, but I don't want to waste a thing on this, unfortunately. Like, Steelix is really good defense, don't get me wrong. I would like to be able to do that. If anything, just for the defense tank. But not Bidoof. But Barrel is not that bad, but I don't want to do a Bidoof. Because I know he'd be the best pawn ever, don't get me wrong. I know the meme would be the best pawn ever. But I don't really want to do that. So we have a... We can get eight pawns all together. Effect Spore and wait. Oh, I think that I think that nature is really bad for him. I think that nature is really bad for him because I think it's down attack, up a defense. Yeah, he already doesn't have good defense anyway. So, oofies. That is an oofies. He is normalized, so no. He is literally a normal, normal badoof. Literally a normal, normal badoof. I need to remember what these fossils were, so then I won't get them again, and I can like sell them or just toss them. But we got three extra pawns, which I'll go ahead and add Onyx to the squad because he is, um, it does help out with Bug, honestly. It helps out with Bug out of everything. So, like, yeah, I, he does help out with Bug. He does. He cool, he's level 20 already. So, yeah, we have Fern. I don't know why I named it Fern, I just did. But he has effect sport, which can become really helpful, too. But he's a pawn. He cannot level up. I think I have to go all the way back and get the metal coat to evolve him anyway. But, yeah. Yeah. I think this is good. Um, but with that, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode off of here. Um, thank you all for watching, everybody. Please like the episode, as it does help out with the algorithm. And it helps me out, too. Because it lets me know that you like this content and keep making this type of content. I already have ideas for, like, the next one or two series. I'm not 100% sure, but I have ideas. But with that, I'll see you everybody next time. Beep.